Today we're going over Acoin's recurring investments and we'll be discussing how you can actually use this feature to automate your investing on the Acorns app. Today's video is brought to you in part by Morning Brew, a free daily stock market newsletter that's easily digestible. The five minute newsletter is perfect for anyone looking to increase their knowledge on the stock market. Get free access today at everydayinvesting.com brew. Hey, welcome back guys. This is Eric of everydayinvesting.com where I'm all about helping connect you with the right financial apps to help you maximize your saving and investing. Today we are discussing the Acorns Recurring Investment feature, also known as Acorns Recurring Deposits. And I really wanna share this feature with you guys because it is a feature that can really help you automate your investing with the Acorns app. Now before we start today's tutorial, I do wanna briefly mention if you are new to the Acorns app, I do have a much more full in-depth Acorns app review to really help you decide if it's the right investing app for you. So with that being said, I'll link up that full video review up above as well as down below in the description box. And hey, with that being said guys, let's now hop into Acorns Recurring Investments. So for starters, what are recurring investments on the Acorns app? Well, recurring investments on Acorns, they essentially allow you to set up an automatic transfer from your external bank account into your Acorns investing account. And what this allows you to do guys is it allows you to set up and automate your investing passively without having to really worry about it or even think about it. Now this is great if you're just getting started investing or even if you're a more experienced investor, but you wanna build some consistency with your investing and build positive investing habits. This feature allows you to do just that. Now why would you wanna set up Acorns recurring investments in the first place? Well, the reason you wanna do this is so you can do what's called dollar cost averaging. And what that means is essentially, you are consistently contributing a set amount every week or every two weeks or every month, however you wanna set it into your Acorns investing portfolio and you don't have to worry about timing the stock market that way. Now this is one of my favorite philosophies in the stock market. It's not about timing the market, but it's about time in the market. Essentially with dollar cost averaging, this means that you take the money you were going to invest and instead of investing it one time in one lump sum investment, you break up that investment and invest it consistently on a set schedule over a period of time to help reduce the volatility and risk of that overall investment. And that's what recurring investments allows you to do on the Acorns app. Now there are two types of recurring deposits you can set up on Acorns, one into your Acorns core portfolio investing account the other into your Acorn Spend checking account. We're gonna go over both today, but we're gonna first hop into how to set up a recurring deposit into your Acorns Core investing account. So in order to set up a recurring investment into your Acorns Core portfolio, you're gonna to wanna to go to the homepage of your app and click on the very top where it says invest for your future. If you click on that, that'll open up your investment portfolio. You then wanna click on where it says recurring in the middle, click on recurring right there. You then wanna turn on the toggle that says recurring investment. So if you turn that toggle on, you can then choose your preset amount, which is how much you wanna set your recurring investment to be. So you wanna click on that and you can modify that number to an amount that's comfortable for you. Again, never invest more than you're comfortable with, but it is good to set up a recurring investment if you can afford to do so. So let's just say for an example, you wanna set a recurring investment of $15. So let's clear this, let's click 15. Let's then do set recurring amount. You can then choose the cycle, which is how often do you want to set up this recurring investment? So click on cycle. You can choose if you want to do it daily, weekly, or monthly. And again, with weekly, you can choose the particular day of the week. Say you want to set up a recurring investment of $15 every week. You can say, I want to do this every Friday. You can click Friday and click on update. Now, all you have to do is click save, and that will set up your recurring investment for $15 every Friday, which is once a week. Likewise, you can go back and do this monthly. Let's say you wanna set up a recurring amount of, let's just say $50 every month. And you can choose the exact day of the month as well. So you can set it right after a direct deposit, right after a paycheck, again, whenever is most convenient for you. So let's say you can even do last day of the month, or let's say you get paid in the middle of the month, you can do the 15th update. And again, once you click save, this will now set up a recurring investment of $50 every month on the 15th of the month into your Acorns portfolio. And as I mentioned, dollar cost averaging your investments over time through Acorns recurring investments is not only a great way to help mitigate potential risk and volatility in your investments, but it's also a great way to build and grow your Acorns portfolio over time. 
Now, in case you're wondering, the minimum recurring investment you can set up into your Acorns portfolio is as little as $5. So you can, again, do $5 weekly or $5 monthly. That's the lowest amount you can do uh, with your Acorns recurring investment. Now, another question you might be wondering is, can I pause this feature or turn it off if I don't want to continue this recurring deposit? The answer is yes. You could simply, again, go into your app just like I showed you and turn this toggle off. That'll then turn off the recurring investment. And again, if you want to ever turn it back on, you just turn it right back through that toggle. Click save just the same. It's that easy. So if you ever run into any particular months where you're a little tight on funds and you can't afford to have that recurring investment take place that month, you can always pause this feature just the same and resume it next month. So it really is that simple. Now, one question I often get with the Acorns recurring investment into your investing portfolio is, what happens after I set up a recurring investment? Do I have to do anything else on my end? The answer is no. As a user, Acorns takes care of the rest. All you have to do is set up that recurring investment like I mentioned. Acorns will then automatically transfer that money for you and automatically invest it for you into your chosen Acorns portfolio. So you don't have to worry about anything. All you have to do is just sit back, set it up one time, Acorns will take care of the rest. Now, if you're familiar with Acorns Roundups, it's the feature on Acorns that's probably most popular because it allows you to invest the spare change from your everyday purchases. And I really feel that recurring investments on Acorns is a great complement to Acorns Roundups. Together, they can allow you to automate your investing, get the most out of your everyday purchases, and really help you grow and build your Acorns portfolio through these automated investment tools. So back on the homepage of the Acorns app here, you'll actually notice that there's another recurring deposit you can set up with Acorns other than your Acorns investing account. And that is into your Acorns checking account. Now to do this, you wanna click on where it says Spend Smarter. That'll open up your Acorns Spend checking account, which again is their mobile banking account that does come with a debit card right here, a Visa debit card for Acorns. And that basically gives you quicker access to your funds on the Acorns app. Now in order to do this, you wanna again click on where it says Recurring Deposit. You can click on amount and set your preset amount. So again, the minimum you can do here is $5, just like they're investing recurring deposit. But let's just say you want to do $25, click confirm. You could then choose how often you want it to occur. Again, you can choose every week and choose the day of the week, or you can choose every month and choose the day of the month. So you do have that flexibility to set up recurring deposits into your Acorns checking account or your Acorns investing account. So are recurring investments on Acorns right for you? Well, I definitely think it offers a lot of benefits in helping you establish and create those consistent investing habits. It also helps you dollar cost average your investment, and it also helps remove the temptation of spending those investment funds on unnecessary purchases. Now, as I mentioned earlier, guys, recurring investments are just one of the many investment automation tools and features available to you on the Acorns app. Again, if you're new to Acorns, I do have a much more full in-depth review, which you can find right there on the Acorns app, as well as several of my other Acorns app tutorial videos right there as well. But again, setting up recurring investments is a great foundation.